Okay, Jujus Kaizen season 2 Shibuya Ark. Guys, if you are only anime watcher, please do not watch this video because it contains spoilers from manga. You have been warned. Here is how Sukuna take over Shibuya and decided to kill Jogo. After Gojo turns Tim Zenen into cocktail, Sukuna's strong presence gives Gojo chills. Then Gojo finds Mimiko and Anako was the one who gives Yuji Sukuna's fingers. Yoyo demands to know how many fingers they feed him, but the girls decline. Then Gojo decided to kill them, but Nanako used her cast technique to hide. Then Gojo decided to make the best of the situation. In flashback, we see Kenjako inform Gojo if Yuji eats 10 fingers at the same time, he will lose control. After Gojo feeds Yuji all the fingers and asks King of Castes to wake up, then Gojo looks over to see Mimiko and Anako they are still alive. When Gojo he wants to burn them alive, he does not realize that his hand is already being cut off. The ominous voice demands Jogo to move. He was none other than Kim himself, Sukuna. Jogo makes distance fast. Nanako believes they cannot do anything stupid because with only aura, it makes them feel like they will die. Sukuna says they are holding their head too high. Girls instead drop along with Jogo, but he did, Jogo did not drop low enough and been cut by Sukuna his technique. Jogo his head was being cut in half and Skuna said one nail is not enough. Then Nanako asks Skuna for a favor to kill the one who possesses Geto his body and they will give him another finger. But Skuna kills Mimiko just after they ask the question and tell Nanako if they can order him around just for few fingers. Despite for revenge, Nanako tried to use her cast technique but Skuna used his slave clove and cut her on pieces. Then Skuna asks Jogo what he really wants from him. Yoga answer, he, he's only, he only wants to wake him up and wants to fight with him. 